Then we eat the afikoman, say the blessing after the meal, sing a few songs, and then we're done. So, as soon as everyone has some wine, we'll begin. Wait. <laughs> we haven't started. Moses had to do something. He was running out of time. I hope this works. seen everything. I'm oh, sorry, sorry, here, here. Hey, we can use saltines for matzo. Okay. Um, oh, bone. Bone, bone, bone. Come on. Perfect. Parsley. Parosin. Parosin. Bitter herbs. Here's your wasabi. Thank you. It's perfect. That's Thank great. you. Thank you. Okay, um, let's all take a moment to take a few deep breaths. Everybody have a nice big swig of wine. Hey, guess what? Okay, get ready, kids. You know what's in here? Matzah. And I'm gonna hide this, and you gotta go find it, and whoever finds the matzah is gonna get a dollar. Each year at Passover, we ask four questions which explain why this night is different from all other nights. So you're just gonna launch right into it, huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> the first reason Passover is different from other nights is that instead of eating leavened bread, we eat matzah. It's pretty bland, but don't quote me on that. <laughs> Nasada, which is where we tell the story of the Jews' escape from bondage in Egypt. Doesn't it seem like every Jewish holiday has to do with them escaping from stuff? No, Chris. And you know, tricking some bigger, more athletic people. Uh, Lois, not that I'm rushing you, but when do we get to the wine drinking? Hang on, hang on. Before we do anything, I'd like to say a blessing over the candles, if I may. Now, bear with me. I haven't had much rehearsal time. <clears throat> Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech alam Asher kidishanu b'mitzvatov V'tzivanu lehadlik ne'er Shel yom tov Can't we just eat? 